occupation of the U.S. East Coast has revealed many American secrets, Head General. My congratulations again, but this war is clearly not over yet. The American will to resist is as defiant as it was upon your first landing, and they set up a new line behind the Mississippi River. Unless your recon can find a weak point, expect serious challenges to any attempt to cross it. After breaking through state capitals from here to here are your primary targets. The Americans have shown that losing their federal capital hasn't slowed them down, so you will need to take the country apart state by state. Now, uh, if you'll excuse me, I have another meeting with the Admiral. There are more American secret data codes, and apparently one thing in particular requires special attention. Something about New York or Manhattan. Either way, good luck on your mission. Thank you very much. All right, welcome back to Pentacore 2, folks. We finished the conquest of America last turn. Well, the first uh, scenario, I think there are probably three, maybe four, I don't know. We got a new hero, overwhelming attack and damage to enemy units is enough to force them to retreat. That's quite nice. And apparently there's something about the Manhattan Project, which is uh, the American nuclear program during the second world war so uh but i'm guessing we won't get to see that in action that would be a bit overwhelming um all right we have some core slots left we have a lot of prestige and apparently we need to move over well take the country state by state so each state capital we we need to take apparently and uh, apparently they're going to put up a lot of resistance as well. We lost our best recon units last time, which is annoying. Now, if we take a look at a unit, do we have heroes left? Oh, we, we do. Learns from mistakes. So that was the learns from mistakes. I think that I put that on a recon, so we got him back. So that's something at least. That's something at least. Okay. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see. Are there any upgrades that we can get? I kind of doubt it. Prototype E75. What's that? 2232 let's compare it to we have panther g's 32 attack on a tank 32 ground defense 17 air defense hmm what does it move only four movement though that's the problem only four movement all right, uh, nothing new here. Anti tank, we have a Yacht Tiger. And Stu, I mean. The Yacht Tiger. Let's see, we're using Stuk now. Quite a bit more heart attack. 32, 14 initiative, 31 ground defense, 15 air defense. But again, it takes up three slots, core slots more, and it moves one slower. But it might be worth it. For anti-air, we have an Ustwind and a Wirbelwind. Uh, right now we are using... Oh, we can't even get that anymore. Or can we? Oh, ah, yeah, yeah, there it is. So... That's just a downgrade, except that it's a lot better in uh, ground defense. And same here, it's just a downgrade. Storm Tiger for artillery. Let's see, right now we are using Hummels. Storm Tiger. 
is cheaper on slots, but more expensive in prestige. It does more infantry damage, more heavy, more hard damage. It has better hard defense or ground defense and it has better air defense and it has better close defense, but it only has a range of one. Fighters, the Messerschmitt 262 A's is no longer a prototype. I like that. Now we have a DO 335A that is a prototype. Eight, 18 air attack. Move a bit further. If we take a look, compare it to this guy. Then it's a definite upgrade. Definite upgrade. It only costs one more, but I like the 262As, I think. Uh, we have for tech bombers, we have a new, a new uh, Hinkel, I guess. Uh, Hinchel. Well, let's see. It's better at. Uh, hard attack. It's a little bit better in the air against. So this is basically uh, just an upgrade. This is an upgrade. Uh, HS is an upgrade in almost every way except ships. And costs one more uh, core slot, but and then there's the same. All right. I am gonna, as per usual, uh, reinforce, replace, upgrade, etc. And then I'll be right back. All right, so everything has been deployed. And let's see what we've done. Uh, we've left our infantry the same. We have basically left our tanks the same, except that uh, I have overstrength them a bit more. And this guy has now got the overwhelming attack uh, hero that we got before. This uh, oh, this guy needs to get some camouflage. Not that it really matters. He has the learns from mistakes hero. Uh, but let's just give him some different camouflage to keep it consistent. So there. Uh, nothing happened to the recon, nothing happened to our anti-tank, nothing happened to our uh, artillery. All our fighters are now uh, Messerschmitt 262s, which is wonderful. And all our tactical bombers are now Henschel 129B3s. So yeah, quite a few upgrades in the air nothing much on the ground we have deployed in three fronts you might say we have a couple of tanks down here let's zoom in a bit so we have a couple of panthers down here supported by a stug a hummel gustav and a grenadier up here we have another couple of panthers with a Stug, uh, two Hummels, and a Granite a Pioneer. And up here we have our Recon together with a Panther, a uh, Stug, a Hummel, and a Pioneer. And then we have two fighters, two tack bombers up here, two fighters, two tack bombers down here. So we are going to go for a kind of a three pronged attack, I think. We'll head in here these guys will take nashville as well i'm thinking because they're on the right side of the river so we'll head into birmingham nashville and then we'll head down towards new orleans probably take uh, memphis up here on the way and then we'll head into houston dallas austin and maybe oklahoma city as well if they have the time these guys will Break straight for St. Louis and Kansas, Omaha, Wichita. While these guys, they kind of hold the flank up here and 
clear out these cities up here. So that's the plan. That is the plan. And let's get into it. And deployment. And hmm, I suppose straight away Gustav is kind of useful. One nine, I can live with that. Okay, overrun. I can live with that too. Uh, let's send these guys up here and see. We'll send one of our fighters to cover him. The other one will cover Gustav. Zero seven, I like that. Overrun. We can't get in there and take the the what's it called? The airfield, just yet. Oh, hopefully he can't make it around and attack Gustav. That would be really bad. We'll see. All right, uh, up here. Should be a cakewalk. Okay. Let's move forward. Hmm. Just head down here and take a look. I'm gonna send you in here and take a look. Kind of figured they would have that anti air there. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Okay. Now. You come over here. Where can our homie get to? There. Okay. And I think that's it for the turn. Oh, one other thing that happened is that I took out my uh, anti-air. I don't really feel like I need it that much. Jesus, they have a lot of planes. That is just crazy. One ten, okay. Wow, six. Three ten. Uh, that's hurting. Gustav got hit. Gustav got hit. You're going to pay for that. Uh, 
two six. Head in here. Plus three is a heart attack. Nice. Okay. Those two are dead. Now, how do we get Gustav out of harm's way? Suppose we can do that. <laughs> All right, no more casualties for Gustav. It's good that Gustav has... Uh, where is it? Single entity. Always attacks as if its strength were at max. And that's a good thing. You need some replacements. This means that you can come in here and bomb. Okay. Those guys are not having a good time. Did you already shoot? I guess you did. Okay. Move in and take that. Can't attack those though. There's a tank up there so we do need to keep our eye on this up here because they have some units hidden away around the place suppose you will head in here and take that right, we're missing uh, we're reaching the mississippi now that is the Mississippi, right? Yeah. That was my cat, if you heard that. Uh, let's elite replace you. You come up here. Actually, Make your way down this way. Okay. Nothing will be able to get to that in from that direction. So I might as well go take this airfield and get ready to start hitting Nashville next turn. There's a big artillery there. I think more planes would have been nice, more fighters. I think that would have been kind of nice. Anyway, uh, that is it for this turn.
and four. That I can live with that. Jesus, they have a lot of planes. Definitely should have bought more fighters. Planes everywhere. Two, three, I can look at that. that that Chicago taken we have Chicago two and four I can live with that two and one let's get their fighters down I guess we'll just delete and place you Send you down here for some cover, I guess. You need replacements. Fix that off, please. Okay. I really want to know if there are units out here. I doubt it, though. I think we'll just right, go stuff. That's Nashville taken, Birmingham taken. I kind of figured there wouldn't be anything in there. Elite replace you. Now you are gonna come in here. Then you're gonna come over here. All right, plus two to our attack. Not bad. There isn't really anything to bomb. And I think I just want him to be safe. And I want Gustav to be safe as well. So he's moving up here underneath that fighter. And I suppose that's the turn. Yeah. Send it. We're starting to take a toll on their fighters, which is good. Three, I can live with that. Zero three, I can live with that too. Bye bye. Okay. 
You're coming down this way. And so are you. And let's see, we can get you in here. On top of the railroad road. Two, three, zero, one. All right, I want that thing down. Which means that Gustav can come down here. Hopefully we're covering Gustav well enough that nothing can get in there and hit him. Can't believe we lost three Gustavs. It really sucks. All right. Let's see. All right, that's another fighter down. Okay, plus two soft attack, not bad. Let's head up here. What are you? Willie's Jeep. It's a recon unit. Alright, so this is our flank dealing with force, I guess. So that needs to get over here and take this stuff. And then push down. Uh, eight, two, five, five, three, seven. Three seven seems reasonable, but yeah, it wasn't that I saw that that changed my mind, really. Because they're gonna be, get hit by everything, and they're standing there on the bridge and. It's just not good. You're not going anywhere right now. You're not going anywhere right now. You're going somewhere. You're not going anywhere. All right. Nice ambush. Don't necessarily understand how we ambushed that, but
I'll live with that. Let's wait and see. Now, we could possibly get rid of that liberator. You guys are fighters, you are fighters, you are attack bombers, you are strat bombers. Liberator doesn't matter that much though. You have to wait and see there. Surprised at those stats, zero two. Okay. I suppose I will take this 2 6. The Stug really isn't supposed to be in front of the tank, but it is right now. All right, New Orleans is cleared. But this looks nasty. But with. Gustav shouldn't be a big deal, really. This up here is worse, though. Zero seven. Alright, what do we have here? Attack bomber, attack bomber, fighter, attack bomber, I think. Let's try and take that attack bomber out. Or at least weaken it down to one. I can live with that. Okay. Two, four. Let's bring you up there. Replace you. Replace you. And then next time we can possibly cross. And I think that's it for the turn yeah in turn uh, it's not gonna be super easy to cross the Mississippi I guess oh. did you take a bit of a beating there Went down even though it had two left? Uh, that surprises me. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it went down as well. Nice. Wow. I don't know what's going on there. They just lost three planes by attacking that that Hummel. I'm not entirely sure what that's all about. Why 
five seven. I can live with that, I guess. All right, my turn. Finish that off, please. Thank you. Finish that off, please. Thank you. All right, we're across the Mississippi. Okay, taking New Orleans. Guess we're going for you. Just rebase everything down here. And that means that you can come down here. Ah, uh, can you? Let's send you down here. No. Actually, it's fine because it only has one uh, strength left that long time, so. It's fine bringing it down here. Okay. I think we're gonna need to rebase our fighters up here as well. Let's go take you out. Let's go take you out. Oh, you can't reach. Dang it. Right, you know what? We'll rebase up here. Salute, so replace you. Let's move you in here. So then you're covering that as well, and you're under plane cover. You definitely need elite replacements. Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. Okay. Don't really want you there on the bridge. I actually think I want to pull you back a bit. And next turn we'll be able to push across with the rest, I think. Don't know how we're gonna come at that. I guess we'll come at that from this direction. Somehow. I actually think I wanna bring you down here so that they can't cross and take that airfield and stuff. I think that's the turn. 
Yep, that's the turn. Well, that wasn't too bad. They're giving it their best. The good old Yanks. Their best isn't going to be good enough, I'm afraid. Ouch, did that hurt? There goes our Stug. No, oh, it survived. Surprisingly, it survived. Right, well. Man, it didn't go down. Let's get you some placements. We'll elite replace you. We'll fire there. We'll head back. You get some elite replacements. You get some elite replacements. All right, one four. Okay, we're across. I don't really want to bring you two across just yet. Um, we brought in a tack bomber here. Let's try and finish it off. Nope. Unfortunately not. Push them. Nope. Okay, next turn. What, I'm going to chance this. And this. Oh, there's a end here there. Five damage to that, though. That's pretty good. I think we have their fighters pretty much under control now. So, I mean, there are a few down here, but they can't reach all the way up there. But other than that, I think we're in pretty good shape. Pretty good shape. But that is going to be it for that turn. Yeah. And you're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere. You all already gone, all of you. You're staying right there. To shield the Gustav. So yeah, that's the turn. And that is also the episode, guys. We are out of time. 
So yeah, we, we're making pretty decent progress here and across the Mississippi, I guess. I mean, we have crossed the Mississippi uh, down here and up here. We've crossed the Mississippi. This guy is not doing well, though. Uh, we have crossed the Mississippi here in St. Louis. And next we'll be crossing here. So yeah, I think we're we're doing quite okay. We're basically crossing the Mississippi on turn seven. So there isn't that much left, actually. There isn't actually that much left. So yeah, going pretty well. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.